How's Lyoto looking? How's he gonna do next Saturday? It's gonna be good. It's gonna be an exciting fight, and uh, I believe Lyoto is really close to to one more challenge for the belt, and uh, he trained a lot, with, a lot for this fight, more than three months. Lyoto never stopped training, so it's gonna be an interesting fight. We, we respect Musas. Musas is, is an amazing fighter, a long time on the road, but I believe the Dragon is. He's right for another belt. He, he, this is his moment, and uh, for sure he's going to bring the belt, not just for him, but for all family. And uh, May event in Brazil is always hard, so he's going to fight in Brazil. Musashi, I think, his first fight there. He's going to feel the pressure, because <laughs> there's a lot of pressure when you're not Brazilian fight there. Benny know that. I, uh, I brought him uh, one time to fight. Yeah, bring him to fight. I brought him to fight in Brazil one time, he and Nolan. And he feel the pressure to fight that and knock the guy out, the <laughs> hero of the city. The, the crowd, huh? Oh, wow, the crowd changed against me. <laughs> no. I said, Brazilian guy, what are you going to kill? You're going to kill? I said, my gosh. So it's really hard to fight the Brazil. And uh, I think Liot is a hero there. And, uh, yeah. It's going to be something interesting to Musashi, fighting uh, in uh, Liot's house against the Dragon. How do you see him now at middleweight? Do you see him quicker? Do you see him stronger? That's good. Yeah. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. I think it's the moment for a lot of new guys show the talent. Anderson has a big injury. He's going to stay out for for a while. And it's the moment that another guy show the skill, show you know, make new idols. I think in sport, maybe we need new idols. We need the new generation come. And uh, Vitor is there. I think if you do have to beat the Musashi, it's going to be Vitor Belfort or Chris Weidman against against Liotto and uh, it's going to be a good fight or Chris or Vitor against Liotto it's going to be an interesting fight. I'm going to ask both you guys this question and I'll go with you first Benny. What's more interesting Liotto and Chris or Liotto and Vitor? Uh, Liotto and Chris. Why? Because uh, Liotto presents a different kind of challenge. He's a puzzle that you kind of have to figure out you know with his movements and uh, his ability to circle. I think uh, with Vitor it's not a disrespectful thing but if you can push him past the first He's not the same guy, you know. Uh, you get him into the second round and the third round, he changes. He starts, you know, slowing down. And um, I think that's the, that's going to be key. And Weidman, I think, was going to know this too. So that's why I think uh, Leota's a better challenge, more complex challenge. And you, Master Rafael, what's the more interesting fight for you as a coach, Leoto and Chris Weidman or Leoto and Vitor Belfort? For us... It's different, like Benny say. If you push Vitor first round, after first round, he, his spirit, he, you can, you break his spirit. If you can push him first round, uh, I think Chris, interesting fight too. I believe it's gonna be a good fight. He's gonna try put Liotto on the floor. Liotto gonna try his move. It's gonna be an interesting fight. I believe Chris against Liotto for the business is better. Yeah. Yeah, American against Brazilian. Brazilian against Brazilian is good for Brazilians, but uh, we live in a different world now. And uh, you know, we talk about business and uh, important for sport in Brazil against United States, United States against Brazil. Uh, for the business, I think it's better. And uh, about the fight, I think it's something you can sell more here, in United States. Chris Weinem against Liot, then Vitor against Liot. I believe, but it doesn't matter. He's ready for both, and uh, he deserve he he expect for. Good challenges, and it uh, doesn't matter who, who comes, he's going to be ready.